Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is ZKT Chaotic. Today I will be reading Operation True Love, episode 64 to 65. Due to Webtoon's new policy, I do have to blur 50% of each episode. So yes, cat logo is going up or else my channel will be get taken down. Stop complaining about it. I have to do it or else, you know, they will take it down. Like I got four copyright strike. I almost lost my channel in 2023 not risking it again and I'm making sure I follow the rule to the T. All right guys, uh, if you guys do want to support me, I do have all my reads on my private channel where I'm not censoring any of the gory or un, you know, explicit stuff. So if you guys do want to support me there, it's on patreon.com slash CKT chaotic. Let's go ahead and get started. Whew. We are about to watch Doa walking in and possibly pummel these dudes but let's see what the hell uh huh doa <sighs> douchebags your gossiping was broadcast to the entire school what huh hey what were we talking about shit we're, we're screwed Who cares? I didn't say anything wrong. I don't give a shit. Actually, maybe it's for the best. At least she might not be so annoying anymore. <laughs> Fuck. I can't listen to this shit anymore. You're the one who cheated on her. So how can you still be so shameless? G what? Hey, what do you say? G Minus, the one who cheated? What the fuck are you talking about, asshole? And who the hell are you to say anything? You're a funny little shit, aren't you? I'm funny. I think you're pretty funny, too. The way you acted all clingy even after Ra M dumped you. That was hilarious. What? Oh, he punched Doa! You hit me first, asshole. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, stop. Shit, we're fucked. What? Oh, Doe's gonna get expelled. Dings. <sighs> You're so stubborn about not playing. Huh? Huh? But you're actually really good. Your eyes. Huh? My eyes? D uh, <gasps> I'm not crying because I'm mini, okay? You know you know that, right? Uh, or am I? Maybe I am. Either way, I'm not crying because I'm sad. I'm angry. Shit, Minu is such an ass. Yeah. He's an asshole. Huh? An asshole who makes you cry every day. Ding dong, ding dong. Oh, how am I supposed to go back to class like this? So embarrassing. Hmm. Permission to go out, leave early. St Here. Don't worry about it. Go home and get some rest. Thanks. Uh, why hasn't the teacher showed up yet? Minu must be out of his mind. There's no way he could have known. Still, he shouldn't talk like that behind someone's back. But if you think about it, Sue did kind of just abandon Minu by ditching him. For Yunyuk. If it were me, I would have done the exact same thing. Huh? Hey, Yunyu, what are you doing? Where are you going? Huh? Class is starting soon. Not ditching class, are you? Huh? Are you? At least take me with you. Operation True Love, episode 64. 
What was that broadcast? Did you do it on purpose? No, <laughs> it was by accident. We had no idea it was on honest. But did the whole school really hear it? Ugh, I don't believe this. Uh, there goes my reputation. Shut it. Why were you even there in the first place, huh? Not to mention you were smoking on school grounds and indoors at that. Don't, know, don't you know it's illegal to smoke indoors? Illegal? And so it's underage smoking. That's double illegal, you punks. We're sorry. <laughs> and what about you, Doa? Your face is all busted up not too long ago. But now you're fighting again? Is it a hobby of yours or something? Are you a wannabe gangster? And why were you there? Were you smoking too? I already said I don't smoke. Then why were you there, huh? You're not even in the media class. Why were you beating him up there? Answer me. Because he deserved it. Why, you little... Oh, my God. You all have to submit a 10-page reflection report by the end of the day for a week straight. Yes, sir. Of course, you all get penalty points, and you're on bathroom cleaning duty for a month. Got it? Oh, my God. What? Seriously? What? Who said that? Those with a problem, feel free to step forward. Never mind. Go back to your classes and doa on your knees. You don't get to go back until you start feeling some remorse. What good is a thug going to do in school, in class? <laughs> Bruh. She slapped him. Oh. Okay. Ruh. So, um, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> what she's up to now? Ruh, I'm you. What do you think you're doing? What's wrong with you guys today? Are all of you high or something? Oh, my blood pressure. Apologize to Sue. What? I said. Apologize to Sue. Do you not see me? I see you, but I'm not interested. Huh. What a fucking psycho. Fuck. You're the one who should apologize, you crazy bitch. Huh? Use your head. Do you think Sue was more upset because of me or you? <gasps> Stop this right now. You're in the faculty office for God's sake. Yeah, Minu, that's enough. Whether you know it or n know it or now, you're still a psycho. What a mess. Just drop her. Why aren't you doing anything? I made a promise. What? That I'll protect her until she got older. Don't laugh. <laughs> okay, but she betrayed you. She didn't make a promise. I did. Operation True Love. Episode 65. Maybe that... Now that makes sense. It makes sense why she has not kicked out Ra M after all that stuff. I thought it was because of her, of her parents, but maybe it's because of her. She made a promise. Let's keep going. Bzz. In you go. Where are you going? Just felt like going on a drive. On the bus? Yeah, <laughs> on the bus. <laughs> okay, have fun. <laughs> She's cold.
Oh. Hmm. Huh? Huh? Oh. Oh. My once complicated and heavy thoughts became clear and light in an instant. I don't want to. I can't really understand if you just explain it to me. Can't you show me? No, it's not that. I just can't. I knew Yunyuk would always be there for me, no matter what he hears about me. If my reputation plummets or whatever happens. This sense of clarity and confidence cut the shackles that once weighed my ankles down immediately. This one step I couldn't take before in the face of a new relationship gave me freedom. Yunyuk, I think I... Hmm? What do you think about what this bold troublemaker is doing? After Sue visited Meringue that day, letters started continuously arriving on the 31st floor. All were sent by Sue. That even worms writhe and kick if you stepped on them. You should have controlled yourself. That's what I'm thinking. Why, you little. Do you see me as a villain or something? Yes. Uh, you tried to kill me. Isn't that going a bit too far? You can ignore me all you want. Do you think I won't find another way? I'm in my last year of high school now, and I'm not focusing at all on my studies. I just look for you every day. What do you think is most important to me now? Even a third year student needs to survive. So let me, let's meet and talk, just the two of us. Besides, you said you won't kill me if I increase my love points, and yet you still try to kill me. Isn't that going a bit too far? You clearly said that you'll spare me if I would increase my love points, even just by one. Why aren't you keeping your promises? Please, meet me at least just once. Feels off. I have to at least try to do something. What's she talking about? Is she implying that I really tried to kill her? That was just a hallucination. A hallucination. Can't she just tell the difference? I just wanted to scare her a little. I'm sure she's talking about the latest elevator incident. Elevator incident? What do you mean? You weren't the one behind that? I just assumed you did it. Meringue. Pro produced by Meringue. That means the screen just happened to get stuck like that. It's understandable that she misunderstood. So what you're saying is, I'm being screwed over and harassed with letters from a high school student. Because of some misunderstanding about something I didn't even do? I've been egged and tomatoed before, but never lettered. How refreshing. Beep, squirrel. Are you still watching Sue's these days? Yeah, of course. How long are you going to keep that up? I'm not sure. 78 out of zero? But it's not total points, so I feel like maybe this system is broken. Until the problem goes away, I guess. Bang! An explosion? <sighs> no way. No way. This has to be an illusion. Please. That's traumatizing. And like, okay, stepping back, things like this kind of like, it seems to happen quite often here in the US. So you always have to be on your toes when you're going out or doing anything because you just never know. Just your luck to go into a Walmart or to be on a bus or just to be in your car and someone who just hates you 
do that to you, you know? Or like just going to a festival, going to a, what's it called? A parade. You just don't know. You have to be always be cautious because nothing is safe anymore. Even going to school is not safe. Just, yeah. But I hope this part right here is just an illusion that the guy, the, the meringue people did. But we just have to wait and find out. Alright guys, if you guys enjoyed the way I read this and react to this webtoon, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up. And if you guys do want to support me for all I do and my readings, feel free to subscribe to my Patreon page, which is on patreon.com slash ckt chaotic. Alright guys, bye!